okay uh, this is second lecture of toc basic concepts now uh, today we'll see what exactly we are going to see in toc okay this is not the technical part i am just telling you what exactly we are going to see okay so it's not anything technical suppose our task is to uh, we want to travel from amravati to pune suppose okay this is our task okay uh, so how how you will travel from amravati to pune we will have amravati then suppose aurangabad then suppose nagar and then pune okay so this is how we will reach from amravati to pune we will have uh, amravati first then we will reach to the aurangabad then nagpur and then sorry nagar and then pune okay so now see we, we are starting from amravati okay so let's see our starting point is amravati then from amravati we will reach to the aurangabad let's say ar for aurangabad okay then from aurangabad we will reach to the nagar let's say nt is for nagar and from nagar we will reach to the pune okay so this is the final destination okay so let's say pu for pune this is the final destination okay now uh, if i want to reach from amravati to pune so when i reach from amravati to aurangabad so it will cost me something let's say it it cost me a a rupees okay from aurangabad to nagar i'll call suppose b rupees and from nagar to pune suppose it cost c rupees okay clear and this is the direction i am moving from amravati to aurangabad aurangabad to nagar nagar to pune okay so now see by looking this uh, mathematical model you can clear, clearly come to the conclusion that you will start at the amravati you will pay a rupees and you will reach to the aurangabad then you will pay b rupees you will reach to the nagar then you will pay c rupees and you will reach to the pune pune is the final destination okay so if i reach from amravati to pune so how 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 much it will cost it will cost abc rupees okay clear it's simple don't worry so uh, if you look at this mathematical model you will come to know what exactly the problem is and how to solve that problem so basically toc we are going to uh, solve the problems math, uh, in the terms of mathematical model okay this is basically we can say a mathematical model is okay now we'll see what the terms are this what what circles we are seeing these are called as the states okay now see from here we are starting and i have shown here arrow that that is basically something called as the initial state means the starting point okay now see uh, then this this we have the normal uh, state normal points okay now what is uh, what is our task basically i'm about to to pune so pune is my destination okay that is a uh, final stop so then i'll say pune is my destination so i'll mark it as like this so this is basically a symbol for final state it simply means you will start from amravati and the final destination will be pune okay so uh, if this 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 is basically called as the final state and this two are the normal state okay now what this a b and c are this a b and c are basically called as the inputs in toc okay inputs what exactly input means see if i give input a to am then i will reach to the state ar correct see i am giving input a to am so where where i am reaching i am reaching to ar so basically inputs are used for moving from one state to another state or that state itself but it's for moving from one state to another state clear so th these are called as the inputs and we have seen these inputs are nothing but a sigma that is alphabet okay so these are basically the alphabets these are called as the inputs a b and c now what these arrows are arrows are something what called as the transitions it shows that from one state to where move to the another state see now these arrows tell us that you have to move from am to ar so from am you will reach to the ar so this this indicates the direction to where you are going to move okay i can move from uh, amravati to nagar like this also directly if, if i don't want this stop so i can move directly here so i can show this kind of uh, transition something what suppose it is, it is costing this so i can show this kind of uh, 
uh, something sometimes uh, suppose you you are reached to the aurangabad and you want to go back to amravati again so you can show this kind of uh, transition also that is basically something what you can move a anywhere okay so these arrows are basically used for the transitions that that help us to move, uh, tell us the direction from which state to which state you are going okay and this 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 a a b c are something by taking which you, you will move from one state to another and this shows the direction okay so this is the initial state this is the final state okay now see suppose i have a rupees only okay now then if i a i have a rupees only so where i will take so see uh, the starting point will be a and i will keep a rupees so if i give a rupees where i am reaching aurangabad okay so if i have only a rupees i'll reach to the aurangabad only but what is the problem i reach to pune aurangabad is pune no so i'll say then it is not accepted because my target is to reach to the pune now suppose i have ab rupees so where i'll reach see again starting point is am so if i put from this ab if i take first a rupees so am and first a rupees here i have b so i'll reach to the if i put take a rupees i'll reach to the aurangabad so then i'll reach to the aurangabad and now i'll left with b rupees so if i give b rupees at aurangabad i'll reach to the nagar okay so if if i have ab rupees i'll reach to the nagar again nagar is not the pune my task is to reach to the pune so i'll say then ab is also not accepted got it now suppose i have abc abc rupees so see i'll start from a i'll take first input i'll reach to the aurangabad okay then i'll take second input i'll reach to the nagar then i'll take third input i'll reach to the pune okay now where i have reached pune and what is my target to reach to the pune okay so see pune is my target and i have reached to the pune so i'll say a b c is accepted okay now what that i'm accepted means if if i reach to the final state by taking some input so i'll call that input is accepted see from amravati i am reaching to the pune by taking input abc so i'll say abc is accepted now see here by taking ab i am not reaching to the pune i am reaching to ng only so i'll say ab is not accepted by taking a only i am reaching to aurangabad so i'll say a is not accepted okay so the accepted term means by taking some input if you are reaching to the final state then it simply means you are string is accepted clear so this is what exactly we are going to see in the subject okay these are some basics don't get confused this, this is not the technical part this is a general example i i just wanted to tell you what are the states states are these things okay what is the inputs and what is the transition clear okay in next lecture we'll see the examples thank you